this. So what we're going to do is we're going to work on transferring a verbal expression <coughs> to an algebraic expression. And if you guys can remember, a verbal expression is going to be us writing out actually what the expression is. We're going to write out our operations. So there's a lot of keywords that we use. Um, if you guys remember the keywords, there was uh, very important things for adding, multiplying, dividing, and subtracting. Um, I showed in a different video for translating all those keywords. I'm not going to rewrite them back up there. I just want to go through this problem. So for this problem, it says 91 more than. <clears throat> 91 more than the square of a number. All right, so when we're working on trying to see if we, how we can write this as a um, algebraic expression, a couple of things that we need to pay attention with is uh, we need to look at kind of what's what's happening. First of all, we have a ninety-one. Yes. What do you have the answer is? You want me to tell you this? Like a, a squared plus 91. Oh. Okay. Let's go and see. Let me go and explain it for those, are, those people that didn't understand it. Let me go and see if I, they can figure it out. Okay. Um, listen. So, um, when we're going through this problem, it says, first says 91, right? So we know 91 is going to be a part of our answer. So even if you guys are really having trouble with this, it says 91, put 91 in the answer. It's the most basic thing. You don't really need to do any math. Right? You just throw 91 in the answer. It says 91, put it in the algebraic equation. Then it says more than. Uh-oh, now I'm starting to think, what is more than happening? So I go back to my you know, thinking, I'm saying, all right, more than. Um, that looks like a keyword for an addition. And I go and think and I look, oh yeah, addition. That was more than, sum, plus, increased by, added to. So more than is going to tell me to add. So it says 91 more than. So 91 plus <laughs> I should be looking up here. It says 91 more than the square of a number. So first of all, we don't know what a number is. And so you chose A, right? Do we choose another number or another variable? Yeah, you can choose anything you want to, right? Variables just represent numbers. So in your case, let's use A. But it says the square of the, of the number. So now we have to think of, all right, what, what was square mean again? Well, we talked about um, the power. Remember, power has a base and the exponent. Well, that exponent was your power. So a couple things we said for powers was, you could say you know, it was squared if it was raised to the second power. Um, it was cubed if it was raised to the cubed power. Or whatever number it was, we just say raised to blank, you know, whatever that number was, power. So the square, and we'll explain later why the second power is called the square. But when it says more than the square of a number, that means it's raised to the second power. So that'd be a number raised to the second power. And when I go and look at your answer, very good. 91 plus a squared is the correct answer. So very good job. Does everybody have any questions on this? Yes? When it says more than, shouldn't you switch the equation around? Yeah. Um, you could say 91 is you know more than. You could, yes, we're in pretty much, um, yeah, I, technically, you have a valid point. It's saying this is 91 plus, you're adding 91 to it, correct? Yeah. So that is a valid, very valid point. I probably should have, to make it not confusing. I kind of kept it the way it is because addition, you know, order doesn't matter. But when we get to subtraction, that's a very, very critical point. So thank you. I, I probably actually, uh, I need to make that more clear. When you say you have 91 more than something, because actually this is going to hurt people in the end. When you say 91, when you have 91 more of something, it actually means you're adding not 91 to it, right? If I say I have five more dollars than you, right? You add five dollars to what you have to see how much money I have, right? So when I say you have more something more than something, 
you're adding that value. So thank you. I mean, in the end, it doesn't really matter because addition, yes. uh, human does worse both ways. But yes, I, I should actually make that clear. So that's how you do a verbal expression to an algebraic. So when you guys are doing your homework quiz, 